stripes? I've told you 500 times. If anybody sees you out of that cage, they'll close me down. Well, excuse me. I guess I'm not appreciated around here. Maybe the carnival would be better off without me. You said it, I didn't. Now, get back in the cage. I've got a carnival to run. Mmm, -mm, that hit the spot. I wonder why Stripes didn't join us. I passed him on the midway. I think there was something bothering him, but I didn't want to ask. Ah, <laughs> uh, you know, Stripes, Elizabeth probably stepped on his tail or something. Yeah, I guess so. Anyway, I told him I'd get his crunchy critters ready. They don't look crunchy anymore. He likes them like this. They're so soggy you can hardly tell the elephants from the giraffes. See? Yuck! Why don't we deliver his lunch? That ought to brighten his day. Good idea, Marvin. Hey, Stripes, where are you? I've got your soggy critters. Well, he can't be too far. His cage door's open. Oh, Marvin, Eddie, there's something wrong with Stripes. I just know it. That's what I said, remember? He just walked over to me and said, see you around, and he gave me this. The key to his cage? Oh, see you around. You know what that means. He's gone. Stripes is gone. Oh. oh, Elizabeth, calm down. We don't know that. Maybe he just gave you an extra key so you could drop in whenever you want. Well, okay, maybe that's a stretch, but... I can't see Stripes leaving. I just can't. He loves it here. We're like one big happy family. What about his Mr. Grizzly Bear? Hey, you're right. He wouldn't go anywhere without him. Yeah, if Mr. Grizzly's here, Stripes will be back by nap time for sure. It's gone. What? <laughs> oh, and so is Stripes. Oh! Eddie, we'd better find Jack. Jack, we we can't find Stripes. His cage is empty. And his Mr. Grizzly's gone. We think he ran away. <sighs> I told him to get back in his cage. He gave me an argument, and I said some things I probably shouldn't have. Gee, Jack, we know you didn't mean it. Yeah, well, I guess that'll teach me not to say things I don't mean. You'll have to talk to him and straighten the whole thing out. I have to find him first. And the sooner the better. Out there, everyone will think he's ferocious. Hmm, you're right, Eddie. I'd better phone the police before someone else does. Oh, dear. I miss Stripes already. I'd give anything to hear just one. Oh, dry up, Elizabeth. <laughs> I'm really worried. What will he eat? Hmm, hard to say. But 32 chickens won't be easy to find. There won't be anyone to pluck the feathers. Oh, you know how upset Stripes gets if he finds even one tiny feather on his chicken. Guys, guys, Jack told me the police formed a posse. They're out searching in the woods for Stripes. We interrupt this broadcast for an important bulletin. Please remain in your homes. There is a 400-pound Bengal tiger at large. We repeat, please remain in your homes. How cold and impersonal can you get? His name is Stripes. I didn't know he was from Bengal. I didn't know he weighed 400 pounds. Oh, we were just getting to know him. Oh. Oh, dear. Sirens. Poor Stripes. We have to do something. What should we do, Eddie? We have to find him and bring him back. Let's go. Hold on, Diamonds. People won't take kindly to a tiger and an elephant on the loose. Marvin and I will go. All right. We'll sit right beside the phone. Be careful, you two.
Stripes may have good night vision, but I doubt he's gonna like it out here in the dark. Yeah, I'll bet he's scared. Psst. Hold it, Eddie. Did you hear something? Hear something? Shh. Listen. Psst. I heard that. Psst. Over here. Look, Marvin. I know that tale anywhere. Stripes! Thank goodness we found you! I'm scared, guys. Th those sirens haven't stopped all day. Come on, Stripes. We're going home. Uh, I'm not moving. They're out to get me. All right, all right, calm down. And I can't go back anyway. Jack doesn't want me. That's not true. He wants you back. Really? Really. He's sorry about saying something he didn't really mean. Did you bring anything to eat? No, but I'll get us something. There's a diner just down the road. Bring me the usual, Eddie. 32 chickens? You'll have to settle for one. I'll get a burger. Don't worry about me. I'll just nibble on something around here. Okay, I'll be back as fast as I can. We found him. It was fine. Calm down, Elizabeth. What? Well, no, he didn't say he misses you, but I'm sure he does. Yep, everyone's okay. Marvin and I are bringing him back in the morning. I just need some time to calm him down. One jumbo lemonade, one roast chicken, and a burger to go. I gotta go. Bye. Thanks, lady. Cute kid. Here's the food. This is nice. A moonlight picnic. Boy, am I hungry. Eddie, I'm still hungry. Here. <laughs> I'll be okay till morning. I'm still hungry. Here, try some sassafras leaves. They're not bad. I'm hungry, but I'm not that hungry. Tomorrow we'll get you 64 chickens. Right now, we need to get some sleep. <sighs> I am sleepy. Good night, Marvin. Good night, Eddie. Eddie? Mm? Do you think it'll be all right tomorrow? With the police, I mean? Jack's had plenty of time to tell them to call off the search. Don't worry, it'll be fine. the guys around yes it is isn't it i can't wait until they're back home safe and sound we interrupt this broadcast to bring you a special announcement from police chief klutz Ouch. <clears throat> sorry this is police chief klutz we've just been informed that the runaway tiger has been located and will be returned to the carnival down the old country road did you hear that? They're on their way home! We ask the public to please stay out of the area so as not to aggravate this dangerous beast. Thank you! Dangerous? Stripes? Why, he wouldn't hurt a fly. Hmm. Uh. Move, Stripes! They're uh. out to get me, Eddie. So help me, Stripes, if you don't move... Where's my Mr. Grizzly? He's right here. No, I'm not kidding. Let's move. Okay, if, if you're sure. We're, We're sure. We must 
must have absolute quiet. Please do not arouse this dangerous animal. Uh, you're the only one making noise. Stay calm. There's a lot of people along the sides of the road. What do you think they want? Steady. They're just here to see you. I'm scared, Eddie. Just keep moving, Stripes. Everything's going to be fine. Think about those 64 chickens waiting for you. Oh, I couldn't eat a bite. Nothing to see here, folks. There's no show today. <gasps> Get back, everyone. Get back. Easy. Easy. It's all right. You just took your picture. Don't you want to see your picture in the paper? I just want to get past all these people. Don't worry, Stripes. We're almost there. There you go, Stripes. The door's wide open. How are you, Stripes? Not bad. How are things going with you, Jack? Oh, check out that crowd! Couldn't be better! Great to have you back, Stripes. It's great to be back, Jack. I've been looking for you. Just grabbing a bite before showtime. You were really great today, Eddie. We were really great today, Marvin. We were, weren't we?